everyone and welcome back to The Sims 3 North Star Legacy and here we are looking at Soot. Look at how fluffy Soot is and he's he just like the cutest little fluffy cat. But we're here with Soot and Cloud, his mate, just kind of seeing how the cats are interacting with each other. They really are very beautiful cats, very in keeping with the kind of goth, like darker tones and themes of our Sims 3 Supernatural family too. And speaking of which, everybody is doing great over here. Gina, where the heck did your wings go? Gina, have your wings just like not loaded in yet? Are you feeling okay? Gina, where are your wings? There they are, there they are. Now they're starting to emerge. That's always concerning when your fairy's wings just like vanish on them. But yeah, so don't worry you guys. I know it's been a while since we've uploaded a North Star Legacy video, but I haven't given up on them. We just had so many amazing projects pop up all at once. We're doing our 101 Dalmatians challenge. We had some fantastically surprising twist show up in our Sims 4 Legacy. So that was really exciting. If you guys haven't seen that yet, you should go out, check out Tevin's baby bump. It's really cool. It's a baby in there. And we're back here with the North Stars. So if I recall correctly, what we're working on right now is trying to get our wonderful Darian, who's over at the alchemy shop, in charge of a whole bunch of the... Oh, where are you? Oh, that's right. He just turned somebody into a vampire. I remember that now. Just a casual, casual day, you know, over at the, the alchemy store, turning people into vampires. I'm sure that's normal. I'm sure that's fine. But he still wants to purchase a venue, own a venue, to invest in, uh, like, the the town and become the elixir monopoly master so we're trying to work on that with him i think i'm actually going to bring him home and then send him uh to the does it require a computer uh purchasing real estate on the computer he's going to have to face his arch nemesis technology and go down into the basement to use gina's laptop for just a minute and see if we can whip out a computer. No, don't sabotage it. He, she, he hates technology. I bet that just irks him that he has to go to a computer in order to see if he can get real estate. Purchase additional home. You can do that. I had no idea if you could do that, and you can do that. That makes me excited because that means that we could purchase like an additional area for them to raise unicorn babies or something fun like that or check out some real estate. In fact, I ima imagine if we purchased an additional home, what if then you use like the Sims uh, multi, like a multi-person mod of like we're using so you can have more than eight Sims and pets in a household. And I wonder if you could just like, can you play both areas at once? Um, I'm kind of curious now. I'm gonna send him home and just see what it says when we try to purchase an additional home. And then also to kind of browse to see what real estate's available. But I really want to get Darian up on that because that's going to be his legacy. He's getting kind of close to being an elder again, if I recall. He's got 53-ish days left, so it's not too close, but he's getting there. All right, and Ariel, meanwhile... What is her favorite music again? Dark Wave, which is so cool. Ariel actually has some opportunities to work on for school. She hasn't done her homework interesting so she hasn't done her homework huh huh well let me see can i send her off to do her homework she still has that nut hatch in her in her pocket let's do her homework gina also has an opportunity she needs to read a science book for work so i'm gonna have her i'm gonna have her do that hmm well i'm gonna have her actually interact with her new son with the brian gloth the clone of mortimer goth uh, and we're fine on that. Hey, little baby. So I'm still trying to figure out how we can change his family tree so he can be recognized as one of the official North Stars. Because right now he actually recognizes Mortimer Goth and he recognizes his brother, but he doesn't recognize anybody in this family. Yay, and we, we got and received some gifts, which is totally awesome. Where are you in? Oh, there's fleas still. No, Cloud, don't lick him. Cloud's like, I'll try to help you with the fleas. Oh no! Oh no! Izzy, where are you? Izzy, we've got to solve this flea issue. Are you, are you like cracking your zombie, or excuse me, your mummy back? I don't think that'll end well. That just looks very painful. It just looks like it's not going to end very well for our zombie friend there. So let's see, can I get the freaking cat? We've tried to get this cat bathed and get rid of the fleas for so long now. All right, what if I come over here? Do I have to click on the cat and be like, here? Uh, give flea bath. All right, pick him up. Cloud, do you have fleas now too? Oh, grody, there's fleas everywhere. What about the baby? Storm. 
Storm, stay away from your parents. They're covered in fleas. You don't want to. You don't want to be involved in that. All right, I'm gonna have Storm come and scratch on this so that he can get his little scratching abilities up. Ariel, what are you doing? Did you finish your homework already? Ariel, what are you doing? Oh wow, she finished her homework like in an instant. That's amazing. Well, now she has the opportunity to complete her writing skill. Where are her opportunities again? Oh yeah, they're over here. Improve writing skill. The school writing club wants her to improve her writing skill. We can work on that. So I'm going to send her down to her room. She has a computer in her room, doesn't she? Yes, she does. So I'm going to send her down to her room and let her work on her writing skill. I love her room. I love Ariel. Like She's just such a fascinating character. It's going to be real fun to send her to university and see her try to kind of bring a un like a magical touch to university in the future. All right, writing, refine. Oh, wow, she can write a lot of things. Holy days, let's just have her refine her writing skill. Is it, like, already pretty high? Not bad, higher than Zelda's. Gina, cuddle that baby. He's sad. Give a bottle. Snuggle. Snuggle. There you go. Somebody needs some snuggles. Somebody needs some attention. Uh, let's play with him. Gina really does love babies, too, so I could see her wanting to spend some time with him. And then we can rock with him for a little while. Meanwhile, Darian's acting like a baby because he's he just saw his mummy. Dang it, Izzy! Stop trying to feed her. Why can I not bathe my freaking cats? What is going on here? All right, we're gonna we're gonna do this. You come here, and you stop greeting the sim and come here. Darian, stop stop worrying so much about Izzy, and go inside. He wants to give Soot a flea bath too. Come on. I love this family, and I'm so glad it's spring again. Now we just need to focus on the cats. You think we could just like magically? Be like, okay, cats, here's a here's a spell. No more fleas for you. Oh, actually, there is that fancy pants little thing we could get, isn't there? Ooh, and a whole bunch of Darian's frogs. His pocket frogs have begun to sell. Ooh, and his flask of angry bees. Not bad. It's a little bit of money coming in there. But that did just remind me that we can get lifetime awards for the pets. And I think that there's one. The pet hydrinator. And it is used to keep your dogs and cats squeaky clean and free from fleas. So if this doesn't work, if we still aren't able to bathe him by hand, then we will definitely make that happen. So Izzy, you stay there for just a minute. Don't move. All right, the cat has entered the room. We are now going to give flea bath to cat. Whoa, okay, so then it lets you pop out when you purchase an additional home. Oh, so we could like get a little a little plot and then make that into our like garden area or something like that. That's so interesting. Or any of the empty houses, you can do that with two. So can you just like travel between the two? Because then we really could just have like a really cool place where we've got a garden that's not on the main lot or where we have like a horse stable or we could even move Zelda and Wyatt back into the family but have them live in a different household technically because they have two homes. So that's really cool. I'm really, really liking that. Oh my goodness. We might move Wyatt and her, uh, Wyatt and Zelda back in then. And then because we play with so many sims at once, we can just kind of jump between the two households. That would be a lot more fun to be able to play them side by side like that. So we might consider that. That might be a thing we do. All right, so back to Darian real quick. Down, no, do, look at him. He wants to sabotage his wife's research station. Do you realize two of your sons have come from that research station, Darian? Maybe you're jealous. Who knows? All right, and now we're going to have him go ahead. Whoops. And we want real estate and check real estate. Come on. Don't be such a fuss bucket. He's like, I can't wait to get away from all this. Did you already break something? It sounds like, oh, you already broke something down here. He's screaming at the computer because he hates it so much. Just deal with it for a minute, sir. Look, Cloud's coming to help you feel better. She wants a, a flea bath, actually. 
Look at him. He's like, I hate technology from using the computer. All right, so here we go. This will let us know the different areas that we can buy. We can get the coffee house, the grown and winery, the gypsy wagon, high products business building, the deep fried diner, holy cow memorial hospital. Oh my goodness. The Legacy Lot, which was actually his old house, I think. The Old Fishing Village, Mike's Corner Store, Lovecraft Library. Oh, there's a resort. The Old Fishing Building is a resort. I didn't realize that. Oh, that's so cool. We could get the Petite Pony Equestrian Center, Plumbug Pictures Back Lot. Um, there's the Day Spa. Sheets in the Wind, the Laundry Mat, which is really awesome. The brouhaha, that's what we're going for, and it would be a property, so we, we can buy it through the computer then. So now I know how to do it, and we need $117,000 to do it. So, yeah, that's not going to help us. Alright, you can, you can get away from here now, Darian. We can leave this area. Lifetime rewards. Can I spend them on anything useful? Jet setter, discount diner, professional slacker, speedy cleaner. Mm, observant, change of taste, compulsive eater. Hmm. Bookshop bargainer, I'm going to get just because we can. And then we'll look at the other things. He's got a lot of points, actually. We'll look at the other things in time. And actually, I think what we're going to do is I'm going to send him upstairs. Oh, that's right. Actually, we have a whole bunch of new. Oh, oh yeah, let's send him upstairs. I'm going to have him chill out up here because we have a lot of new elixirs that he needs to learn the recipes for from our modded elixir stuff. Oh, I'm so excited about that. All right, and meanwhile, are you bathing that cat? Why are you not bathing that cat? What is going on? Bathe pet. Soot North Star. Soot, where are you? You are going to remain right there. Don't you dare move, sir. Don't you dare move. Oh my gosh, why? Why are you having to go upstairs for this? I am going to get to the point where I'm going to have to just like put a bathtub in the living room to get this done, aren't I? Also, who's complaining about what? Oh, I think Darian's still complaining about the fact I made him use the computer. Come on, pick up the cat. Do you not have a good enough relationship with him? Oh, I don't think we have a good enough relationship with him. Is that why? Okay, Darian, you're excused so that you can bathe your cat. All right, come here. And we're going to... Give a flea bath to Soot. Meanwhile, Izzy, you're going to clean the house. Never. How's our girl over here? She's getting a little sleepy. Oh, she wants to throw a slumber party. I've never seen that before. Talk to Soot. Uh, she wants to stay on the honor roll for three days. Okay. Uh, and also research science. And have five friends, which I thought was really cute. Why do you have a romantic interest? Well, I guess she's into bald men. <sighs> Alright, actually, I'm going to swap that out. There we go. Now are we bathing the cat? Why are we still not bathing the cat? Okay, there's the kitten. The kitten is cute. I know the kitten's cute. Affection. Let's, let's talk to the kitten for a second. And then I'm just going to freaking, like, put a bathtub up here. Because I'm completely at a loss. We have bathed the cats downstairs before. But I am completely at a loss. This is a battle against fleas now, you guys. It's getting serious. We're a magical family. We can explain the appearance of a bathtub in the middle of the living room, right? We can totally write that off, right? All right. Uh, bathe pet. Cloud. Well, I guess we need to give... It actually needs to be soot. Okay, give flea bath to soot. Don't give it to your kitten, soot! No, Storm! Stay back! Stay back! The fleas are so real! We're doing battle with the horrible fleas! Oh, soot! Soot, baby! Why can't we fight, like, the fleas magically? This is so sad. Look at our poor cat. He just looks so agitated. So many fleas. So much not cool. Alright, we're talking to the kitten. Gina's improved. How did Gina improve her logic skill? Gina? Oh, you're not playing with the baby. Here, go downstairs and fix your, your machine so that you can work on science. Unless she's tired. No, she's not that tired. Alright. You work on repairing that. Your daughter, meanwhile, can go to bed. Sleep. And then she's got her dragon. I want to play a lot more with many of the dragons. Alright. Why are we still not giving the cat a flea bath? 
Give flea bathtubs at North Star. There's a a bathtub right here. Oh, so hissed at him. Why? You two are like best friends, aren't you? <gasps> we have no relationship. We're letting our cat suffer because we have no relationship with him. Okay, that's it. We're going to brush him. We're going to feed him a treat. We're going to talk to him. Meanwhile, the little storm back here is thinking about butterflies. So this is why... This is why Soot says, no, you've ignored me. The fleas are my friends. Fleas are not your friends. These fleas are not feline friends. That's not how this works. Is you still cleaning? She's going to go read something. I want her to... Can she contact Thane even though it's so late? Let's have her chat with Thane. She's a good nanny. She'd do that kind of stuff. There you go, Soot. We'll even play with you a little bit. We'll have some fun. Yay! Gina's fixed her station. I'm so glad. Alright, so Gina's fixed her station and she's done playing with the baby. How's the baby doing? Baby might need a diaper change pretty soon, but there's nothing we can do about it until then. So Gina, you're going to go ahead. And where's that book? We have a science book we need to read for work and we're trying to get promoted. Oh, she still has that picture of Wyatt and Zelda. That's so sweet. And she has that rhinoceros beetle. And we're cloning the death flowers, which has been proven to be very, very useful. I think it's this one. Advanced deniability procedures. Oh my goodness, what a name for something to have your work. Especially your work in, like, top secret, science-y, like, science-y medical military places ask you to read. All right, we're going to let her chill out down here with all her jellyfish and her little robot fish swimming around over here. How, how's the cat? There we go. Cat relations are slowly improving. Alright. Is Soot going to trust us enough now? I guess you would need to have a high degree of trust. Oh, he's so not happy. Arabella Pruitt. Um, wow. Okay, Arabella Pruitt is being taken in. The eldest of the Pruitt daughters, or the Pruitt children, the other witches in town, is being taken in by the feral wolf, the werewolf in town. Not a good thing. She should stay away from him. He's nothing but trouble. All right, can we bond with? Can we bond with the kitty? We have a good relationship with Cloud, at least. So you're really gonna have to just trust us. I'm gonna give you some affection. Gonna talk to you. All right, we need the nanny to get on it. We're taking care of the baby. He messed his diaper a little bit. It happens. Don't worry, Brian. It happens to the best of us when we're nothing but little tiny, tiny guys. And then snuggle. And then she'll put him back after that. Oh, see, everybody wants to take care of the cats because we're battling with these fleas now. Cloud, could you please get out of the way? You may not sleep at the top of the stairs. There's a baby who needs taken care of, and you're blocking Izzy. Izzy, can you please go take care of the baby? Like, you can you can do that now. Oh, dear. I'm sorry, Brian. All right, changed her diaper. Snuggle. Have we repaired our relationship enough with Cloud now? Okay, Cloud. It's time for a flea bath. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh! Come on, Cloud! Alright, we're just gonna have to brush him a lot. Affection. Oh my goodness, I had no idea it would be so hard to try to convince the cat to let us- Don't get on the furniture, Cloud! <laughs> no, Cloud! You're covered in fleas, too! Slowly but surely, repairing our feline relationships all over the place. I'm leaving that, that bathtub there until we get this done, because that way we can get it done easily. Alright, how's the baby? Baby's doing well. Let's gonna put the baby back in the crib. And we're going to go back to cleaning the house, because you left puddles everywhere, Izzy, because you went out in the rain. There we go. Alright, Cloud, do you trust us now? You're feeling familiar. I know we have neglected you. I know it's not been easy. Here, have another treat. Affection. Oh, we can pet him now. Come on, Cloud. Now, now Darian. Darian's got fleas now. Oh, no. 
<laughs> his loyalty to his cat has proven to be one of his itchy undoings. All right, somebody's feeling really loved and happy. We're going to talk to him again. Oh, we're really having to work for this, aren't we? Let's play. Let's have fun. Random teenagers are getting a job at the mausoleum. That's fine. Affection feet treat again. It seems like the, the source to Cloud's care and happiness is in feeding his stomach. All right. Ariel is sleeping. Brian's sleeping. Gina is reading that book. And we're still working on the flea problem. Why can't we just magically vanish them? Thane thinks everyone... Oh! Thane thinks everyone at La Fromage Art School is weird and the right side of Thane's brain is exhausted. Can Thane come home? Oh, he wants to come home. Oh, that's really sad. He's only been there a few days. You know, we're going to say no this time because it's the first time he's asked to come home. I think he just left on Friday. So it's been like his first day of school. He left like Saturday. So I think it's been like maybe his second. This is like his very first day of school. So this is where you have to go. No, honey, let's just try to like hang out for just a little bit longer. So we're going to say no just so he can try to get used to what it's like being there. All right. So if you don't let us do it this time, guess what? You're getting to go into a machine. And you know Darian's not going to like that. All right, come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, I had no idea it would be so hard to get rid of fleas. That's making the 101 Dalmatians penalty challenge for if your animals have fleas look really hard. I know, I know you have fleas and it's sad soot. All right, are we almost, have we won your trust back over? He's, he's scratching everything. Too bad Zelda's not here. Cloud and Zelda got along real well. Come on. All right, we're going to talk to him again. Gina's still studying. What does she want to do? Take out the trash. Let's sit, sniff her hand. Befriend a vampire. Don't you dare slow dance with him. Come up here. Affection. Uh, let's sniff hand. Affection, talk to you. I guess, the, I wonder if the mummy... Uh, did we just get refused again? So this is going to be your last chance. Okay, that's it. So, all right, you guys, we're moving on to more high-tech solutions. Traditional methods of kindness to your kitties and trying to entice them with treats have failed. So we are going to switch from Darian to Gina's viewpoint on the world. And Soot is going to have to pay for his own little... <laughs> <laughs> pet hydronator. What the heck this is? Who knows? It's in our family inventory now, so let's go ahead and whip it out and give it a try. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Anywhere, anywhere I can put this? Okay. Right over here somewhere. And there we go. Okay. Okay. Well, we're definitely not curing the fleas the old fashioned way anymore. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so you brought this upon yourself. You've denied us the ability to tend to your fleas. Look at look at look at Cloud. Cloud's like, um, oh look at him. He looks nervous. This is this is oh my goodness, really. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh, here it goes. Oh my gosh, look at all the fur! Alright. And out pops a clean soot! Yay! So you should apologize. You friendly, friendly beg. Because you should apologize for turning him down for so long. Alright, Cloud, you're gonna get bathed now. So that we don't have to worry about those fleas. There we go. And Izzy, I'm gonna give you something to do. Do not slow dance with Darian. You stop that, lady. You stop that. I'm gonna have you go ahead and... Just go chat with one of your friends. There you go, Soot. Alright, Soot's now clean, and we've learned we desperately need to, like, prepare, repair our relationship with him. Because look at, look at what happens. Look at what happens. Oh, yay, and Izzy has been uh, upgraded to woman of the house by the town council in recognition of her valuable contribution to the workforce. Good! So she's keeping the home tidy, the children fed, and everyone happy. So she's doing quite well. But yeah, okay, so it, that's your punishment. That's that's what you both got. I guess everyone's clean now. 
but this is just more examples of how technology is superseding that wonderful intimate family connection where you can't even bathe your own cat because it's just going to hiss at you. And that's just going to make Darian cranky. I predict many family days coming up. I really do. Alright, so Izzy's doing great. The cats are much happier. How's the baby cat? Baby cat's happy. How's Ariel? Ariel's happy. How's your mom? Oh, free vacation! Izzy Lapis and all the adults just won a sweepstakes and have been awarded a free vacation for two days. Go ahead and relax while you're away from the teens in your household. Don't worry about a thing. Um, you know, the ironic thing is, I think Ariel would actually be super responsible, but it would be kind of fun to have her use her dragon to throw a party. So I think that's what we're going to do, is I'm going to accept this. I'm going to let all the adults go off on their little vacation, and I'm going to let, um... Ariel throw her little party and try taking care of well we wouldn't be able to take care of the baby brother so never mind if the baby brother wasn't here we would do it baby brother's here though and Ariel is probably going to stick to her guns and just be be diligent ah look at her be so responsible but all right all right the flea catastrophe is finally over and we're finally back to just enjoying some nice quiet evenings here in the North Star family no, you don't, Darian. Do not go downstairs to sabotage. And the one last thing... Oh, Darian has fleas. Never mind, the flea catastrophe is not over. <laughs> take a bath, take a bath. Oh my goodness. How's he feeling? Invigorated from his elixir. That's why he's feeling uh, pretty invigorated. But what we're going to do next time is we are going to let the ladies work on their opportunities and we'll try to get something for Izzy to do. We might get her back to sculpting. She really wants to make more friends. I think she just did. Yay! She has another friend! Good, so we'll really try to help her out by making lots of friends. Let her get closer to the cats. Let her get closer to Zelda and some of the other people in town. Send her out to meet more people in town, probably. They're getting used to the idea of having a mummy in the area. There you go, Izzy. You need to bathe pretty soon, so we can also have Darian give you a charm for that in a little bit. Um, I'm going to have her bake a, bake a something, because she does love baking. <gasps> Ooh, is that some fresh bread? Ooh, it's been, um, let's clean that up. And then let's serve dinner. Let's serve... This is kind of for the morning, so let's serve some country bread for the morning. And the baby's hungry! Oh my goodness! Okay, never mind, Izzy. You're going to come take care of the baby. Alright, never mind that. I'm coming, I'm coming. It's okay, he's hungry. A little bit lonely. I'm noticing he's a lot more demanding than our other babies, so I wonder what that means about Mortimer's personality. That we're constantly having to come down, and he needs a lot more attention. But he's also like the first human baby <laughs> that we've ever dealt with. So maybe that's it. All right, but yeah, plan is tomorrow, let the girls work on their absolutely amazing uh, opportunities and continue to do what they do. And we're going to have Darian, once he's flea free and ready to take care of things, we're gonna send him upstairs probably next episode and we're going to start playing around with the philosopher's touch. So we're going to drink that Philosopher's Elixir, or use the stone, I mean, and transmute some gold. So we're going to start putting down some objects on here and transmuting them into gold so we can see if we can get him that elixir shop as his venue, and if we can help him so that he can once again master all of the new elixirs, which include really interesting things like turning people into aliens and things like uh, turning horses into unicorns, and I'm going to look more into that buying a second home thing, and if it works the way I think it does, where you can just kind of play in two houses at the same time and not have to transfer between them, then I may very well move Zelda and Wyatt back in with the family because we have the mod that will allow us to do that and we'll just play with them at the same time. So it might be a little bit chaotic that way, but man, the North Stars, they're pretty fun. They're huge. So we'll think about it. We'll think about it. And I will see you guys next time. That's right. Do you have any fleas tucked anywhere, Darian? Feeling pretty good? Feeling pretty good? I'm glad. All right. Well, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.